started, ladies and gentlemen, with eight players. Let's do this. Bracketeering coming at you. We're going to play two games of bracketeering, and then we are going to go into the uh, the trivia murder party. Important questions. Your answers will be paired off in a no holds barred tournament, and your votes will determine which answers advance in the bracket. As we whittle down to our championship winner, this is bracketeering. This is bracketeering. Sending the topic of our first bracketeer devices now. First topic to your devices now. Instrument that's not the guitar, drums, or piano. Sexiest musical instrument that's not the guitar, drums, or piano. So ready. Type in the best answer you can think of and hit send. If your answer wins the entire bracket, you'll be rolling in moolah. By the way, you can join the audience and play along by going to all right, all right. TV and entering the room code. Yeah, deadly will. Feel free to always join. Um, I actually do Jackbox Sundays every first, third, and if there is a fifth, fifth Sunday of the month. So every other week, basically, unless there's a fifth Sunday, and then we get two weeks in a row. But every odd numbered Sunday, I go ahead and do some Jackbox for everybody, for all my friends, all of the viewers inside to show up. We're actually kind of low on Time's people tonight. Out. Drix isn't here. There's a bunch of people not here. So my goal is to get enough Your people playing that I can just get a mod in. Matchups. That means it's time and, uh, to sidle up to the prediction I get your predictions. And I want to get a mod in as first player, and then I just want to sit back with people and just make fun of stuff and if be in the audience and things the like that. that so. will get the most votes, you could win some sizable bonus bucks. Oh, and don't forget... Because that, that would be, yeah, that would be fun for me. Answers, just kind of sit back in the audience, do votes, make fun of stuff, and let you guys play. Just kind of be the the game for you guys to play. Instead of actually being a participant. All right, sexiest musical instruments, not the guitar, drums, or piano, flute or the lute. This could get ugly. Use your device lute, to winky face. To win. I'm gonna go with the lute. Don't forget, if you change your mind, you can change your vote. I went with the lute because lutes are awesome. The clock is running out on voting time. Looks like the lute's gonna win. Good job, loot. Some heads were spinning on that one. Prediction one, Vendetta. Good job. Any prediction loss. Tranquility. Robo Duck. All right, the loot moves on. on to our next tuba versus Tuba. <laughs> I wonder who's gonna win. Uh, I think Tuba will win. People just hitting it back and forth like me. I'm just gonna go until it runs out, guys. I'm just gonna go until it runs out. And whoever gets it, gets it. Right, let's go back and forth. Tuba got it! What did I tell you? Tuba got it. THD. Oh, Zach did not get it. So, bottom Tuba one. Okay, bottom Tuba one. Alright, here we go. Bells versus bass. Bass players get no love, man. Come on. Bass players get no love. I'm gonna vote for it, but it's technically a guitar. It technically it's really is. It's a bass guitar. Unless it's like a stand-up bass, and it's not a guitar. True. That's true. Bass moves on. That is music to my. If you can play some good stand-up bass, man, you uh move on. Ishi prediction one misses, loses the prediction. All right, last grouping coming up. Cowbell versus triangle. I gotta I have more cowbell. I have a fever, and the only prescription is more cowbell. No one thought it would be this close. Will Will Ferrell? Nobody really did think it was gonna be that close. It was four to three. Oh, Mod and I both voted for Cowbell, so we got uh, some extra coinage there. It's time to make another prediction. All right, another prediction. Hey, you got a new matchup waiting for you on your device. Predict the one you think is gonna get win. Your, get your predictions in, ladies and gentlemen. But which tuba was it? Deadly well. You played the tuba. I actually played trombone. 
and the bass trombone at that. In. So I basically played the tuba Let's parts. Jump back to our bracket <laughs> for round two. The lute or the tuba, guys. Loot or tuba? I want to see how you guys are voting. Tuba two, tuba three, one for loot. Right now, tuba in the lead. Oh, it's loot coming back with that two points. Two to three right now with tuba in the lead. But time is running out. But loot, no, loot does not get the extra vote in time. Tuba, tuba gets it. And mod and tranquility both get their prediction. So tuba moves on. Who will Tuba go up against? Will it be Cowbell or will it be the base? Both of these answers have seen adversity before. Gotta have more Cowbell. Do I need to go put on a shirt that's way too tight and way too short for me and just get my Cowbell and just start going at it and do the, the Will Ferrell? I don't actually have a Cowbell, but I'll, I'll use like a soda can or something. Cowbell one. Yeah. 75% means 75 coins. <laughs> How are you going to vote against that, Ishii? How are you going to vote against that? Really? Alright, Cowbell versus Tuba, guys. Cowbell versus Tuba. Cowbell versus Tuba. Cowbell! In the lead with five! Oh, oh we're going back and forth! One and five, six votes for Cowbell! Are we gonna get that full that full sweep right there? Seven votes, seven, seven for Cowbell, none for Tuba. Oh no, Tuba, Deadly Whale, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's a shutout, seven to nothing. One thousand coins. Let's see those yeah. scores. Alright. Captain in first, 2232. Mod in second with a thousand. THD, Tuba gets a thousand. Loot. It's time for the blind bracket. Rip. We start with just the category. All right. Write any two words and place and or ampersand between them. Go okay, ahead and, and or the ampersand. That comes to mind. We'll see the real bracket title after the answers are all in. Yeah, the cowbo was too strong, man. Cowbo was too strong. I mean, it's all Will Ferrell. All thanks to Will Ferrell, man. You won't see me streaking like Will Ferrell, though. We're going streaking! Through the quad and into the gymnasium! Who is we? They're coming! They're coming! Let's see what oh this no, THD, is no! About. You get one in. Pro wrestling move. Coolest pro Time wrestling move. Yes. <laughs> oh, coolest pro wrestling move. I love that. The blind bracket. But I, I do like triple blind, but I think I might like regular blind bracket first. Deadly Whale, where are you? Get your prediction in. Two, what? Time's running out. That's time at the prediction table. Let's see our first matchup. All right, matchup. first matchup. TNA versus you and me. Can Coolest pro wrestling this? move. I think I think TNA is an actual pro wrestling move. It's somebody's finisher or something. I don't know. Uh, we all know what TNA stands for, but I believe it is an actual like wrestling this finisher. Like Seven to two for TNA it. right now. Eight to one. We got a switch vote there. TNA wins win at the end. Eight to likes. one. Eighty-nine percent for TNA. Captain and Zach get the prediction. TNA moves on to the Next semifinals. Up. Next is cock and balls and grilled cheese These and tomato soup. Some harsh words at the press conference. I don't know, guys. I don't know. Three to one right now in favor of grilled cheese. But Cock and Balls gets that too. It's coming in. Even game. Tie game. Three to three right now. What's it going to be? Oh, no. Both switching back and forth. 
Five to four, five to four. Cock and Balls takes it at the end with the vote switch. And it moves on to face TNA. Prediction, Tranquility and misses. This is Wilson. Let's see what tensions are mounting. All right, let's get on the other side of the bracket. First matchup on the other side. Phillips Head Screwdriver and Koalas versus Hookers and Blow. We all know it's winning this. All right, three to one for Hookers and Blow. Four to one for Hookers and Blow. This is a tight one, guys. Five to one for Hookers and Blow. Six to one for Hookers and Blow. I think we might have found our winner. Seven to one for Hookers and Blow. Going back and forth, back and forth. Seven to one, though, for Hookers and Blow. Eight to one. Finishing out with that eight to one. Hookers and Blow, 89% getting them coins. Vendetta getting that prediction, but Mod prediction lost. Sorry, Mod there. Hookers and Blow moves on to the semis. Peanut butter and jelly or hoof and mouth? Ooh, it's actually pretty good. You know what? Five to one for peanut butter and jelly. PBJ winning it right now. One vote for hoof and mouth though. I'll tell you who that vote was. Myself. Five to two, six to two, seven to one. Looks like PBJ is going to move on to that semifinal. A regular juggernaut. A regular juggernaut. All right, we got one person in the audience too. Welcome, audience member. Glad to have you. I missed the predictions there. You guys saw. Before we get on to round two, it's time to make another prediction. Another prediction, guys. All right, we just got Master and Deadly Whale. Master and Deadly Whale. Your predictions in. Deadly Whale's in. The predictions are in. Predictions are in. Let's jump back to our. We go TNA versus Cock and Balls, guys. Tits and ass or cock and balls? I think I know what I'm voting for. What I'd like to see more. Somebody going back and forth. Oh, it looks like we got a five to four. I don't know, I can't tell if people are going back and forth. I actually think C C and B is gonna beat TNA. C and B does beat TNA. Oh you guys. Oh, I know Sheena and Trink will Yeah, went for the C and B. Oh, I lost the prediction. Dang it. C and B moves on. So is it peanut butter and jelly or is it gonna be hookers and blow? I think uh, we know which one it's going to be. 3 to 1 right now for HB. PBJ has one vote. 4 for HB. 5 for HB. 2 now for PBJ. 3 for PBJ. Oh, it's going back and forth. What's going to win? I think it's going to be HB, but PBJ, a strong contender, and HB moves on. So our final is going to be C and B versus H and B. What are we gonna get here, guys? And now the final face-off. What is the coolest pro wrestling move? Hookers and blow or cock and balls? All right, let's see. How, let's see what you guys think. We're just fighting back and forth. It's pretty even here. Oh, but it looks like hookers and blow might have taken the lead. I see a five. In there, a seven in there, a six in there. Oh, H and B is gonna win this one, guys. I'm pretty sure. H and B does win six to two there. Good job, Vendetta. Good job. We had some good ones in there though. Like that first round, everything was Let's just like smashed. Like you would do with H and B. But all right. Compton at TNA gets the 600 points. 20 points ahead of Vendetta right now. Tranquility coming up in third. Mod in fourth. THD in fifth. It's all been all right, triple blind bracket, guys. So every single round bracket. is something new, and it's all this blind. Will change every single round. Ah. Here's your starting category. Give any short insult. Who knows what crazy twists and turns this bracket will take. Hmm. All right, we're just waiting, waiting on Deadly Whale. Waiting on that Deadly Whale. 
can go ahead and kill this room code off. Time's running out. Bada bing, bada boom. PhD, come on, man, come on. Yeah. Let's see what we're dealing with. That's tagline for a real housewife to say during the opening credits. <laughs> Time to get in those predictions. Oh man, Townsend Cynic. Welcome to the this round. So uh, choices count. Stream. And Seattle Kid, welcome back. Welcome back, Seattle Kid. Welcome to the stream, Cabri. All you guys are entering that barrio, Your man. Predictions are in. Welcome, Let's guys. Welcome. Bang. All right. You're a peppermint dingleberry or short dick McGee. Oh, wow. I'm going to go with the uh, the PC. Or the PC. The PG one. Six to one for Peppermint Dingleberry. Four Six to two three, now. Short Dick McGee seven. coming back. Six to three. But Peppermint Four Dingleberry young, young takes it. Moves on to those semifinals. What an upset. Oh, wow. That's Tranquility awesome. and Mod both lost that prediction. Next up. Come guzzling gutter slut or cock juggling thunder cunt. Cock juggling Thundercut off to the early lead. Five to one over the Come Guzzling Gutter Slut, but Come Guzzling Gutter Slut at two right now. Three now. It's three to five. Three to six. So it looks like Thundercut might get there, but four to five. Back to three to six. A cock juggling Thundercut moves on to the semis. Can it beat the Peppermint? I love this. Hey, Townsend, how you doing? see what's going on on the other right, side, side of the bracket. bracket. You twerp, that's what she this said. Well, that's obviously going to win outright. It's at 4-0 right now. That's what she said. 6-1 to one over you twerp. Or 1-6. to 1-6. to six. This, is, this is pretty simple. That's what she said Should completely easily. One that. that might be our winner of the triple blind. THD and Vendetta getting their predictions on that one. Good job, guys. Moves on to the semis. Let's see our last grouping. Idiot or fucktard? One to two. One to three. One to four. One to five. One to seven. Fucktard apparently is going to be walking away with this one rather easily, ladies and gentlemen. You will not be denied. Ishii and Zach get their uh, their stuff Let's on that one. Up this bracket. All right, what's it gonna be? Best name for a restaurant where the waiters insult you. Best name for a restaurant where the waiters insult you. I think Peppermint might actually win this one. You're a Peppermint Dingleberry might actually win this one. Over cock chuckling Thundercut. THD, you are like a three-eyed puppy inside a mech suit. That's cool, man. That's cool. Time's running out. Or is that like a scuba puppy? Time's up at the prediction table. All right, here we, we go, guys. To our for Your peppermint two. dingleberry, a cock juggling thunder cunt. Cock juggling thunder cunt out in the lead with one. Tied two to two, one to three, two to three. Two to four. Three to four. So close. Four to three. What's gonna be? Dingleberry at five three. And Dingleberry's gonna move on, guys. Dingleberry beating the cock juggling thundercut. Cause it's so perfect perfect for this answer, man. It's so perfect for that that the question. Just one match away from our finals. All right, here we go. That's what she said. Her fucktard. This is why we do this, folks. Oh, it's tied game right now. Two to two. Two to three for fucktard. Three to three. Tie game. It's not changing hands like it was, but three to four right now. Fucktard in the lead. Five to three. It shifts. That's what she said. 
wins at the buzzer with that switch. Let's swing in the votes, as the announcer said. Dada misses. Ishii and THD did not get their prediction. All right, final switcheroo, guys. Best pet name. Best pet name. Still makes sense. And now the definitive match. I think Peppermint's moving on, man. You're a Peppermint Dingleberry. Oh, that's what she said. Has one bow, but Peppermint Dingleberry. <laughs> Whoever came up with that was clever. It's four to two, five to two. Back and forth, back and forth. I see a seven though for Dingleberry. I said, see for that's what she says too. Seven to one is our final score there. Wow. Dingleberry, the long shot, the Cinderella story. Good job, Mod Powers. Let's see who won it all. That's fantastic, man. Final score. No, I lost a Vendetta. Are you kidding me? By less than 100 points. Dude, I at least got the That's semis right, every man. time. That's what she said. Yeah, yeah. All right, so is there anybody out there that wants to jump in? We can go ahead and get a new setup going. Might Coolest well pro wrestling it. move was hookers and blow. You won. You won one, got to the finals in another, and got to semis. Yeah. That, that's how you beat me. I had you on the uh, on the predictions. All right, let's jump back out.